Let's introduce two trusted connections to each other. And this is one of my favorite parts. And just for a little bit of fun, I'm gonna do it from the Netflix site, just to show you that you can open My Most Trusted from anywhere. So as usual, you start by clicking on the little icon on the top of your screen. Remember, it might be hiding behind the puzzle piece, so make sure you pin it if it is. So to introduce two people to each other, you're gonna use the little search icon over here. So go to search. And then you'll notice that'll bring you to a list of all your, your trusted connections. There they are. So I'm gonna introduce Cherie to Warren at the moment. So very simply, I'm gonna use this little button over here, this little handshake icon to introduce them to each other. Now notice this little trust o -meter. This is going to really revolutionize the way that you build credibility within My Most Trusted. It's really cool, and I'm gonna to get to the trust o -meter in more detail later. Suffice to say, you want to reach the super connector status because I personally run a private group only for super connectors of the group, and you wanna make it to that status to be in that group. Okay, so now I'm going to click on the introduce button. So I'm going to introduce Cherie. I click on introduce. Who would I like to introduce Cherie to? Warren Haas. I can then click Warren Haas and it starts building it already. Hi Warren, allow me to introduce you to Cherie Leone. Cherie, Warren is amazing, wonderful, blah, 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 blah. Now, I hope I don't have to teach you this, but if you belong to a networking group, or you do networking a lot, you will know that you never introduce people in a salesy way. You never say so-and-so is gonna sell you something. It's always about win-win and synergies. That's how you will make sure that that meeting will be booked. So this is not a hard sell process. You can edify and make the person really credible. Warren is amazing, he's brilliant at what he does. He's an excellent CTO, he's wonderful, but obviously don't get too sales pushy and then you click the introduce button. Now I'm gonna show you another way to do it, which is even cooler, okay? So I'm gonna go away from Netflix and I'm gonna to go to LinkedIn. Now I'm on LinkedIn, I go to Cherie's uh, LinkedIn profile and I click the handshake button over here, introduce Cherie to one of your trusted connections. Now this is really cool, watch what happens here. I click the introduce button, same as I showed you just now, okay? Same as I showed you just now. I search for Warren Haas, there he is. So, hi Warren, allow me to introduce you to, uh, to Cherie. Cherie, Warren is amazing, brilliant CTO. All right, I think you guys are gonna work magic together, blah, 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 blah. You then click the introduce button. Now, when I click the introduce button, a couple of really cool things are gonna happen. Right, first of all, it's gonna send an email to all three of you making the introduction. So that's the first thing that it's gonna do. The second thing that it's gonna do is it's gonna build a group chat with all three parties. There's Cherie, Warren, and you see it's automatically built it for you and written the message. Hi Warren, allow me to introduce you to Cherie Leone. Uh, Cherie Warren is amazing, brilliant CTO and I can edit it if I want to. It's built it for you and all you need to do is click send. So the introduction has been made via an email and it's been made by a LinkedIn message as well. So I can click send to send that message and I've now made that introduction. And even cooler, it actually builds a LinkedIn post. I just introduced these amazing people together, Warren and and, uh, and Cherie, um, meet Cherie Leone. It writes a little write-up about them, the brilliant managing director at MMT, the exceptional and brilliant chief technology officer, et cetera, et cetera. And it even does the tags and writes a little message for you. So that's a little LinkedIn post. And LinkedIn really likes um, these posts and you'll see quite a lot of LinkedIn activity and it's good for your LinkedIn profile when you make those posts. So that's really cool. That's how you make an introduction. Now I'm going to open MMT quickly and I'm going to show you what the result of this is. Okay, so first of all, the first result is this little button over here, the referral history. This gives you a referral history of everyone that you're introduced or that you're making introductions to. So you can click on this at any time and what's really cool is you can follow up any introductions that you've made in the past. So a while I, a while ago, I introduced uh, Joanne Books uh, to Susan Jerima, for example. I can click the follow up button and it will automatically bring up a message. Here it is, see it's building the little message. Hi Susan, hi Joanne, did you manage to meet? If so, how did you two get on? So you can actually follow up the introductions that you make. This is some of the really cool tricks that you can use within, M within MMT. Uh, itself. Now, finally, I want to quickly show you the trust meter I alluded to it earlier, 
and I am going to get into a little bit more detail, but the trust meter is available on your dashboard and anybody can see it when they're on LinkedIn or on My Most Trusted. So if you go to your dashboard over here, for example, it's going to show you um, the trust meter and where you are on the trust meter status. You go from the newbie to junior networker to senior networker to super connector and trusted advocate. And it will show you what you need to do to reach the next on your dashboard. So when you click on your dashboard, it'll show you what you need to do to reach the next uh, status. And I'm going to show you over the next series of videos how to get to senior networker and then ultimately to super connector because you really want to get to super connector. So that's how you introduce two, two people to each other. Have fun, make introductions. And trust me, guys, people love being introduced. It's one of the greatest things that you can do in business. And in return, they'll make great introductions and referrals to you.